Well, that was yesterday morning. Today, we're working on the combine. But, uh, because this was this morning. <laughs> uh, something that I'm kind of considering now is, uh, you can't see it, obviously, but I got a pretty good crop of uh, barley coming up already from last year. If you watched my video from last year's harvest, I said I made a comment about planting 200 pounds an acre of barley. Well, <laughs> maybe not that much, but uh, it's coming up. So my original plan was to get peas and then turn them under and give the combine a break this year while I could tinker with it and focus on hay. But because I'm back to work now and I'm busy and uh, I'm thinking I'm just gonna put some fertilizer on here and plant barley again. Now that the sieves put back together, the uh, reel seemed to do okay. It's still a little fast. But my uh, conversion from flat chain to belt seemed to work okay. Uh, it did get hung up in the heavier stuff. So I might have to make an adjustment there or something. I'm not quite sure. Um, but now, yeah, I mean, it's doable. The, uh, let's see, what else can I show you here? Working on the exhaust pipe today. I'll get back to that here in a second. The uh, Pittman arm that I made last year held up just fine. I didn't hear any issues while I was running out there, so I'm pretty pleased with that repair. So, yeah, today, and then of course I told you about the sieve. So I just got to put that all back together. And now that I got a better idea of how much uh, to open the fan and open the chafer for barley, uh, I could probably get a better harvest. <laughs> anyway, okay, so we're doing the exhaust pipe today. I managed to save, there's a couple threads left on the pipe, and then I chiseled out the stuff that was broke off inside the manifold. I cannot find this manifold anywhere. Or this pipe but you could remake this pipe if you have to but for the sake of cost and convenience and I'm gonna try to get away with it I got some extreme high temp JB weld I'm gonna take this back off this is just a dry fit right now I'm gonna unscrew it wire wheel it inside and out and then I bought a uh, clamp for up there and I got a bracket. I'm just going to bracket it to the angle up here. So, yeah, we'll see how that works. So, that's the project today. It's like making a peanut butter sandwich.
Okay. Will it hold? <laughs> I have my doubts. We'll see. I have to wait for a few months. Thanks for watching.